Hello and welcome to Wonder Why Farm and Homestead. Today we're going to be talking about the Ryobi pole saw. Stick around. Hey guys, welcome again. Let's get right into the topic today. Today's topic is going to be about the review of the Ryobi pole saw. I got this thing for Christmas from my wife because when she's riding around the tractor she said she's tired of getting hit with trees. So um, I'm going to put it together here and we're going to do a little bit of trimming and I'll give you my assessment of it. So this is the saw out of the box. It comes already put together. The chain is already on it. The one thing that you do have to add is bar and chain oil. Like that. Just regular bar and chain oil that you use in a regular gasoline powered chainsaw. Uh, it comes with three poles. You have the, the main pole there with the saw tip on it. And then you have, they, they slide together. They're actually notched like that. Once you get them in the notch there, then you put this tightening collar up. Tighten it together. And this is a, a, a cordless, cordless uh, battery operated 18 volt. There's the battery. Now it does not come with a battery. You have to buy the battery separately. But the one thing about this, this Ryobi stuff, all this Ryobi 1 stuff, is they all take the same battery. So if you have this battery for one Ryobi, um, this is the 18 volt lithium. Uh, they fit all their tools. So, snap that in there. Same with this here. Put it up together. Line up the collar. Like that. Once you seat it down in there, then you can just tighten up this tightening collar around it. And there you have it. It's all put together. <clears throat> so once you have it once you have it together there we're gonna we'll go ahead and we'll cut this tree up here, a couple limbs off of it. So hopefully you are able to see all that. Um, I'm pretty impressed with this little saw here. Uh, it's actually done a really good job. Um, so I, I'm, this is really the first time I'm using it, uh, but, I'm, but I'm really impressed with it. Um, if you don't need the height of the saw, you can take this intermediate pole out and actually make the saw a lot shorter. You can see I only have the one, one paw on there. Yeah. Still works. So overall, I'm I'm really impressed with this thing. As I said before, you put uh, you put bar and chain oil in this, just like you do any other saw. And right up here is the filler for that. Take that off, fill that up, cap back on, which I've already done that. And then on the side here, there's actually a, a, a little indicator. Um, where you can actually see the oil in there. So 
Um, you know, if it ever gets low, you can go ahead and fill it right back up. So overall, I'm impressed with this uh, this little pole saw. Um, it, uh, as you can see, it, it went through uh, these limbs here uh, with ease. So I'm impressed with uh, impressed with that. Um, like I said, it comes fully assembled. All you gotta do is put the battery on it, attach the poles together, and uh, go out and do some limbing. So. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. Hope this review helped you out. If you're looking uh, for this saw, I'll put uh, I'll put a price um, down in the uh, description of this. Uh, what they're going for right now, I'm not 100% sure. Like I said, this was kind of a gift. Also comes with a chain guard. And put over top of it there to uh, protect yourself and from getting cut and protect the chain a little bit. And I'll put that description down in the or excuse me the uh, price for this down in the description box. Again, I hope this helped you out. Uh, if you're looking to buy one of these, um, this is nice. Uh, no cord, no gasoline, nothing like that to worry about, just to charge that battery. Until I see you guys on the next video, hope you're staying happy, safe, and healthy, and God bless.